Good evening. Thank you for joining us. I'm Yoon Jung-min. We start with the intense heat affecting thousands of young scouts gathered in South Korea's Semangam area. The authorities are sending cooling buses, freezer trucks, among others, to, to the campsite to keep them safe. Our Choi Soo-young reports. As the Royal Scout Jamboree in Korea is being marred by heat-related illnesses, hygiene issues and COVID-19 outbreaks, the government has taken action to respond to the situation. On Friday, President Yoon Suk-yeol approved a 5.2 million U.S. dollar budget for the response. One of the organizing committees, the Ministry of Gender Equality and Family, on the same day decided to increase the supply of ice-cold water bottles per person per day to five, more cooling masks, hats, sunscreen and ice packs to ensure the safety of the participants. The committee will also install and run 130 cooling buses and 10 freezer trucks. The number of cleaning and pest control personnel has increased from 70 to nearly 550. The organizing committee reported that until Friday, almost 1,500 people had visited hospitals, with approximately 800 of them receiving treatment for heat-related illnesses, as well as bug bites and sunburn. Also, since the start of the event on August 1st, there have been 28 confirmed COVID-19 cases and two scout members have left, but there have been no announcements of any grip outbreaks yet. In light of these circumstances, the organizing committee temporarily stopped 170 out of 173 outdoor activities where participants would be exposed directly to the scorching heat. Amidst global attention, the committee acknowledged concerns regarding communication, shortcomings in event preparation systems and the challenging environment. They assure that they are fully aware of these issues and will take full responsibility to ensure the event concludes safely. Chesu Hyung, Arirang News.